7 Fun Facts About Telecommunications in Nebraska 1. The 911 System of Emergency Communications, now used nationwide, was developed and first used in Lincoln. 2. Alexander Graham Bell is credited with inventing the telephone in January 1875. A few years later, the first telephone made its appearance in Lincoln. 3. In 1880, the American Telephone and Telegraph, ATANT, opened its first exchange in Lincoln with 50 lines. 4. In 1907, four years after the Lincoln Phone Utility opened, the Bell Systems attempted to take over competition by underselling services. 5. The Lincoln Telephone Company grew in the area. It changed its name to Lincoln Telecom in the 1980s. In the mid-90s, it was bought by Alien Communications. Altel eventually took over Aliant. Windstream now owns the former Lincoln Tant. 6. One of the first ever at-home work positions, women could make extra money as operators, while also caring for the family. 7. The federal government's decision in 1948 to locate the Strategic Air Command SAC, near Omaha was a key reason that Omaha became a state-of-the-art communications center. SAC, now U.S. Strategic Command, had a mission to lead U.S. military operations in the event of a nuclear war. They needed the most advanced communications system possible. As a result, the local telephone company installed an incredibly large and complex telecommunications infrastructure, staffed with people who knew how to run it. It built a communications network that could stand up to a nuclear blast. Peter Kiewitzons Incorporated was the construction company that dug the trenches and laid the cable. Eventually, Kiewit realized that businesses might want access to all that bandwidth, too. For a risky $10 million, they built a high new high-capacity telephone network in 1987. By 1992, Omaha became one of the first cities in the U. S. to receive a fiber-optic cable network. Omaha was wired with fiber-optic loops and major trunk lines supporting the telemarketing operations. As of the end of the 20th century, Omaha still had some of the most advanced telecommunications infrastructure in the nation, in equipment and people.